November 18, December 1888. Two editions from Colonel Bureau introducing Mr. Davis. The phonograph salutation. The latest born of science and of American genius, then it me of steel and bowed its neck of iron in reverential homage before the veteran statesman of England. Mr. Patterson, the phonograph salutes you. And through the medium of the phonograph, Mr. Edison greets you. Now, Edison, Listen to a voice that has electrified its generation. The voice of William Stuart Blake. Allow me to offer my hearty good wishes and earnest prayer that you may long to live to witness triumph in all that appertains to the well being of the life. William your Big Ben went to the London, striking half past ten, a quarter to eleven, and eleven o'clock, July the sixteenth, eighteen hundred and nineteen, record made by Miss Ferguson and Graham Hope.
I am not leading this fight as a matter of aesthetic pleasure. I am leading because somebody must lead or else the fight would not be made at all. I prefer to work with moderate, with rational conservatives, provided only that they do in good faith strive forward toward the light. But when they halt and turn their backs to the light, sit with the scorners on the seats of reaction, then I must part company with them. We, the people, cannot turn back. Our aim must be steady, wise folks. Gentlemen, be seated. Grand opening chorus, Old Log Cabin in the Dell by entire company. Cause I'll be the first black angel ever seen. 